So on this one, we're going to need highlighters. And it says from left to right, we're going to draw vertical lines from the smallest to largest number. So here, or furthest to the left, furthest to the right is essentially what it's asking for. So those two are touching at negative 3 and 3. So my smaller number is negative 3, my larger number is 3. When you're doing these kind of problems where you have endpoints, and there's no arrows, there's no ordered pairs, it's just a drawn figure, you do X with these inequality signs. And then your smaller number goes on the left side and your larger number goes on the right. Since this is an open circle, I'm sorry, since this is a closed circle, it needs a line underneath. Since this is an open circle, you leave it open. Now you guys should remember that domain is your or are your X's. So this one's asking us to use a different color and we're going to highlight the highest and lowest point. Now don't get confused on this because this is your lowest point. Some of y'all like to stop at zero. That's not the lowest point on there. That is. And for some of y'all, y'all don't see this negative here. So I have negative two to nine. So my numbers, my smaller number is negative two, my larger is nine. Again, when it looks like this, you start like that. Now the lower number, the smaller number goes on the left and your larger number goes on the right. So here, unless you do, unless you see an open circle, you, you do not need a line. So here, this is a closed, for all intents and purposes, that is a closed circle, or it's a closed point. Okay, you don't see an open circle. This is an open circle. Since it has an open circle, you don't need that line underneath. So your last part, these values are called your range. Okay, we're going to go through this a little bit quicker. Alright. Here, this is an error. Okay, your ordered pairs that you need on this are negative 3, 0. negative one seven four sorry zero four and a half four three four four and five six okay so the key thing on this is when you see ordered or uh, points like this you want to list the ordered pairs and we start them with braces. I like to call them squiggles. So if you hear me say open and close with a squiggle, this is what I'm talking about. It's actually a brace. Okay, so your domain, I don't think we've talked about this yet on this paper. Um, we've said Dr. XY. Your D and X go together. Your R and your Y go together. So domain X range Y. So your X's are negative 3, negative 1, 0, 4, and 5. And for those of you who are asking, you only need to write that once. It could be, the 4 could be there 10 times, you still only write it once. Okay, your range, um, starting from the bottom to the top, is 0, 3, 4, 4 and a half, 6, and seven. And then you close with the squiggle or a brace. Is this a function? You guys are actually pretty good at this. So there's the vertical line. It tells the vertical line, so it is not a function. All right, so domain. 
I need y'all to remember that f of x just really means y. They'll have that on your pay, on your EOC test. They'll have f, f of x. Just remember that's the same thing as saying y. It's a fancy way of saying y. So your domain is with squiggles or with braces, negative 1, 0, 1, 2, 3. With braces, 3, 5, 11, and 21. Does it repeat? Only one arrow is coming out of each one of those x values, so it is a function. Last but not least. All right, so domain. Do you see how there's arrows at the end of this? Well, as you would continue going from left to right, the graph would continue to get wider and wider. So your graph would go wider and wider and wider. So it would it would not get to a point where it wouldn't continue to get wider. So this is all real numbers. And again, we abbreviate that with that symbol. Your range. Some of you guys have forgotten or have slept since we talked about range with a quadratic. Okay, if it opens up like this, your numbers are increasing. So it's getting greater. Here, if the numbers are going this way, your y values are decreasing and it's less than. So here, it's the, the arrows are going down. So I need, oops, I need the less than. Now, is this an open or closed circle? Technically, it's closed, so I need the line. 